Night and day are catching hell People think are doing well Just because I sing a few calypso But that is my misery Calypso don't make money But most of them don't know That was as a result of the quality of representation That they got from the Barbie representative People of cities, what about the quality of representation That you have had? All broken promises Joblessness People have gone nine, ten months without electricity and water, all because that the UPP and your representative, Harold Lovell, has presided over the worst run of economic performance in the entire English-speaking Caribbean. So my task was to coordinate and to bring the team back together and to ensure that we are leading a spirited campaign. And I said to you tonight that I have no doubt that the team that is with me, that is behind me, that is encouraging me, day by day, is ensuring that when the next general elections are gone, we will be victorious in St. John's City. Tonight is a short night, and I know you have a lot of other speakers to listen to, but I want to say to you, victory is nigh in St. John's City, and we will be victorious. We will return that seat to the forms of labor, and we will have the opportunity to start the work to rebuild your economy and improve your life. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, for listening. St. John's City East coverage in France. And now we're in the East, so we're gonna stay here, but we're gonna go over to All Spades East and St. Luke. And coverage, this ain't no flu. Let me uh, introduce to you my friend and my brother, the man who's gonna represent that neighborhood in the 2014 election. He is your friend, you know him. Welcome, comrade, Harlan James. Come on Are we going to vote for our comrades and friends? 
but that can be right. And I say that will not happen. Not in my backyard, comrades and friends. Go away. Not in my backyard. They did not perform for 10 years. So they will truly receive their punishment on election day. It is that simple. They did not perform. So we punish them on election day. And when we punish them, comrades and friends, ladies and gentlemen, we will restore pride and dignity to all saints, traits, Don Hughes, and Old Road. I will work with the people and the new Antiguan Bobby Little Party government to ensure that their jobs for the young and old improve the infrastructure in the community and the constituency as a whole. We'll give you better roads. Do you want better roads in your constituency, comrades and friends? Do you want more working street lights in your community? It's dark in Antigua, comrades and friends. Those street lights are dark in several areas of the constituency. We will work with the farmers and the fishermen to improve their economic livelihood. We owe them that and we make sure that they receive it. We will assist the youth and the elderly who are the most vulnerable. We will not hurt more cultural artists while working with the existing ones, those who are designing the performing arts and the literary arts, and the list goes on and on. But comrades and friends, let me hear you. The message from our says, Issa said, look, is clear. When there's no representation, there must be punishment. And when the government does not perform, there must be a change. Good night, comrades and friends. Thank you very much. Who thirst and hunger after righteousness, for they shall see the kingdom of the Most High. Blessed be God forever. Sila. Come on in. Hey. We're bringing your representative to you. And the next representative is from just around the corner here. The people in this neighborhood call him David. I asked them why. They say because you know what? He is gonna slay Goliath, the man who's gonna tame the giant. We know him as Comrade Lundell Benjamin. You know he's from the.